Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another manual graphics tutorial. Today in this tutorial we'll be learning how to link objects, sorry, link materials between objects. So if you don't know what I mean, when you have a fairly large scene and you've modelled everything and you're ready to set up all the materials, let's say you've got a selection of trees that you haven't used the particle system to place um, and you want to make all their leaves green. You do this by simply right clicking and selecting your selected material. But, would you like to do that with every single one, or would you like an easy step? So an easy step, I think, or that you could use, that I've used in the past before, um, before this tutorial, of course, is using the Control L command. So what I'm gonna show you is how I'm gonna link all these materials to just one sphere. So I'm gonna set, oh, I've chosen this red here, I'm going to select all these other four, three cubes, make it four just, just, just for purposes. Um, all these four cubes, uh, four spheres, to that material without going to this panel at all. So we're going to just select all of these, holding shift. And we're going to select our main sphere. We can hit Control L on our keyboard, and we can make a link with all these different um, materials. So you can do it with uh, all these different objects. You can do it with modifiers, animation data, and uh, obviously materials. And when we do that, all of the spheres that we want selected have been changed that set of material. So let's say we want this in this green now. We just want that one, and that one, and this one, obviously, to our green. So we're going to select the two, all the objects we want, and the main object that we want the link to be made to. And we're going to hit Control L, Materials, and of course it applies it to the materials. So this is just a very short tutorial um, for this week, because next week I've got a super long one planned. Um, but anyway, I hope you... Uh, learn how to make simple material links like this in Blender. So thank you very much for watching this tutorial and I shall catch you in my next video.